In this video, I'm going to be talking about the number one complication of childbirth, perinatal mood and anxiety disorders, or PMADS for short. Here's what you need to know. PMADS are a group of mental health challenges that show up during pregnancy or the postpartum year. Some specific examples of PMADS are perinatal depression, perinatal anxiety, perinatal panic disorder, perinatal OCD, also known as perinatal obsessive compulsive disorder, perinatal PTSD, also known as perinatal post-traumatic stress disorder, perinatal bipolar disorder, and perinatal psychosis. PMADS as a whole are probably a lot more common than you think. PMADS impact new mothers, fathers, and parents of all genders. They show up for new parents of all ages, income levels, and ethnicities. It's estimated that one in seven new mothers and one in 10 new fathers will experience a PMAD with even higher rates among communities of color. The hard news about PMADs is when they're left untreated, they can become very serious. While many new parents will experience baby blues after the birth of their child, which can include mood swings and tearfulness throughout the day, this experience will often pass after about two weeks. PMADs can last much longer, feel much more intense, and get in the way of day-to-day -day life. Here are some signs that could point to a PMAD. Feeling overwhelmed with intense emotions like fear, sadness, anger, shame, or hopelessness. Having frequent scary thoughts about something bad happening to your baby. Losing interest in activities you used to love having significant changes to your appetite, feeling especially exhausted because you're not sleeping at night, even when your baby does, feeling regret about having a baby or worry that you might not be cut out for parenting, wondering if you're going crazy, feeling disconnected from or misunderstood by your loved ones, having thoughts about hurting yourself, your baby, or someone else. As you can imagine, any one of these experiences could have a negative impact on your life if it stuck around for a while. Over time and when left untreated, PMADs can have lasting harmful consequences to a new parent and their developing baby. Here's the really good news about PMADs. They are highly treatable and with support, they can be temporary. If you think you might be experiencing a PMAD, then consider reaching out for support. Working with a therapist who's trained in perinatal mental health can help you to prevent, manage, and heal from a PMAD. So whether you're looking for a therapist or free support groups or just more information and resources about PMADs, consider checking out this next video. I'll share some tips for how to find perinatal mental health support near you.